Welcome to the News at 11. I'm Vic Carter. And I'm Rick Ritter. Neighbors in one Baltimore County community pushing back now against plans for a new business in town. Those plans call for a new crematorium to be built on Philadelphia Road in White Marsh, just about 130 miles, 130 feet rather, from a daycare. And new at 11 o'clock, our Kelsey Kushner on your corner tonight, hearing from neighbors who attended a heated meeting and why they say a crematorium does not belong. Well, a lot of neighbors tell me that they have some major health concerns with regards to building this crematorium, but the owner says that they have done testing and that testing shows those potential emissions are below state limits. We're just very concerned. Anthony Dudek has been living off right Philadelphia Road, Road for over 40 years. He says the last thing he wants to see across the street is a crematorium. Having a crematorium. Uh, right there in, in the center of your um, community is a, a lot of negativity. Wednesday night at an informational meeting about the proposed building, emotions ran high. This is going to be crap. Yeah. And we all know it's going to be crap. I don't feel as if I'm being resistant. Neighbors met face to face with Charlie Evans, owner of Evans Funeral Chapel and Cremation, who plans to build a crematorium by 2024. I want to be a part of this community, I want to serve this community. But neighbors say the crematorium won't serve them at all and will only destroy property value and emit toxins like mercury to an area already battling pollution. Mercury is a known neurotoxin. The manufacturers of the proposed crematory's equipment say testing shows the pollution meets the state legal limits. We are well below the criteria that they established. Earlier this month, a bill was tabled that would have prohibited the construction of crematories within 500 feet of any residential property. This Neighbors awesome. like Heather Patty say if the Intense. plans are approved, wow. the crematory will be less than 200 feet from restaurants, a busy shopping center, and a daycare. Environmentally, aesthetically, it's just not the right location. Tonight's meeting is just the first step in this process. The Maryland Department of the Environment says that if plans continue to move forward, they will hold several more public hearings where neighbors can come out and give their input. Reporting in White Marsh, Kelsey Krishner for WJC.